Hey, hey guys, welcome back. Today's nail art is tropical drink vibes. Sunset tropical drink vibes. <laughs> Something like that. Boop. Let's get to it. Alright, so here's the vibe. We're using the jelly polishes, and I tested it with yellow, pink, and orange. I don't remember, <laughs> but I decided to go with the orange, pink, and I forget, I f why am I forgetting the name? Anyway, base coat time. Let's put on this base coat. I'm using Peely Base, because I'm working with my hands lately, so uh, the polish is going to get messed up anyway, so it'll just pop off and that's fine. So originally I was thinking of doing like a little gradient um, using a sponge like sponging it on um, and it looks really pretty on the sponge like look at that wow but I said no uh, because it would because the polishes are so sheer it would take I feel like it would take so many <laughs> uh, so what we're gonna do is use these two jelly polishes but also use a polish from the vacation collection and yeah, the orange is gonna be like the base and then it's gonna be a little gradient. So we're using uh, Box Office Bomb, Life and Plastic, and Private Villa. Private Villa was the one I could not remember the name of, but yeah, that's the one. <laughs> and since we're doing a gradient for all of my nails, we're gonna start with the lightest shade, which is the orange, and just put on that initial layer. And I'm starting at the cuticle, and the cuticle is going to have the darkest shade, so I'm going to start with Private Villa. And in addition, I'm going to put some on the paper and use a little striping brush, detailing brush, and just put that initial layer of Private Villa at the top. You could probably start at the bottom if you wanted with the lightest shade, but I want to start with the darker shade at my cuticles, so starting there. Okay, looking good. Next, we're gonna use Life in Plastic. And that's gonna be the middle layer. Ignore the orange on the paper because I accidentally <laughs> thought I was doing orange next, but I wasn't. Uh, so yeah, Life in Plastic, the lighter pink. And that's gonna go in the middle. And I'm overlapping it a little bit um, over Private Villa. Just the teeniest bit. Yeah, nice, nice, nice. Honestly, a little bit hard to tell the difference. <laughs> and finally, we're going back in with Box Office Bomb to fill in the, what do you call that? The free edge, the bottom edge, the non-nail cuticle, the non-cuticle side. Anyway, fill in that part in now. It's really, it's neat how the orange like starts to pop. And I'm also doing the same thing where I'm overlapping um, the orange over top of the pink a bit just so it's more gradually blended and not just you know color of block of color block of color block of color <laughs> all right and the initial coats done I'm basically gonna do the same thing uh, for all three of them and still doing a little bit of overlapping also uh, for the second coats and yeah Thank you. 
putting on that last bit and there it is it's so pretty <laughs> and oh i didn't do a little thingy for this but i'm also putting on a gold flake taco just for a little extra something something a little extra oof and i thought it really helped bring the whole look together to have that little bit of light gold and then finally finishing it off truly with our glossy taco to seal everything in Oh yeah, for some reason, that initial coat of Glossy Taco, my nails were still a little bit bumpy, so I'm actually doing a second coat of Glossy Taco to kind of get everything smoothed out. So, it could be, it's probably user error on my part. <laughs> She's looking good. <laughs> and this is just the same lighting that I've been using. <laughs> Inspection time. Alright, starting with the thumb. Look at it. Wow. <laughs> I feel like it's less about the polish and more about my cuticles, how they look <laughs> in this situation. Um, it's always a fun reflection too. Oh, there's a little bit of something at the bottom of my nail there. A little bit of fur or some fuzz. Ooh, a little bit of gold flake taco hiding out in my cuticle at the top there. That's okay. Hmm, middle finger. Mm, okay, I like it. I like it. Probably could have done a little bit more cleanup at the top, but that's fine. There's also some gold <laughs> on my actual finger. Ring finger. Okay, looks good. Looks good. I mean, honestly, I mean, it's all the same. <laughs> it's all the same polish, so there's not like much critiquing. Little, little pinky finger action. Oh, wait, no, that's still my ring finger. This is a long roll for my ring finger. What's it doing? All right, now pinky finger. Look cute. Okay, okay. <laughs> yeah, it's all the same. <laughs> it's all the same design. <laughs> Gradient. <laughs> Which is nice. It's refreshing to do. Just a full gradient manicure sometimes especially when they turn out so nice and with summer coming to a close but not really this is this is nice this is a nice one inspection over what did i really inspect not much all right we're doing shade to sun shot with my special guest boy in the background Ooh, look at that Ooh, that pop bop <laughs> that pop into the sun Ooh. Tea. Oh, itchy blue back there. And because of the orange, I found this little uh, wooden fox figurine that I bought while I was visiting Germany. And I thought the orange just kind of matched. And fun fact, although it was after I did my nails, I think. I think, actually, I don't remember now. Anyway, at some point last week or the week before, I was driving and a fox crossed my path. It like ran across the street in front of me. Um, and then went off into the woods, and that's it. Thanks for being here. <laughs> Bye!